apply superposition theorem to the network shown in figure for determining the current in 100 ohm resistance we have to determine current through this 100 ohm resistance using superposition theorem solution now first we will consider this 100 volt so we will write consider 100 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources all other sources so here we can see there is only one source here so if we turn off this voltage source it will be short circuit now if we turn off this 50 volt voltage source so this will be short circuit here we can see positive terminal is here and negative terminal is here the current flows from positive terminal of battery to negative terminal of battery so the direction of this current will be like this let's say this is current i prime now we have to find this i prime so here we will use current division rule now to use current division rule we need this current total current i so according to current division rule i prime is equal to this current into opposite branch resistance that is 20 ohm divided by 20 plus 100 20 plus 100 so first we have to find value of this current i so we have to simplify this 20 ohm parallel with 100 ohm 20 ohm parallel with 100 ohm so this will be 20 into 100 divided by 20 plus 100 20 into 100 divided by 20 plus 100 so it is 16.6 16.6 ohm or in fraction it is 50 by 3 so it is 50 by 3 ohm now we will replace this circuit by 50 by 3 ohm so here this will be Fifty by three ohm. Now from here we can find the value of this current I. So I is equal to V by R. V by R. The value of voltage is hundred volt divided by resistance. Resistance is eighty plus fifty by three. So eighty plus fifty divided by three. So this will be. Hundred divided by eighty plus fifty by three. So it is one point zero three. One point zero three ampere is the value for current I. We have to find I prime. So I prime is equal to I into twenty divided by twenty plus hundred. and this is the value for i i is equal to 0 1.03 so this will be 1.03 into 20 divided by 20 plus 100 so therefore i prime is equal to 1.03 into 20 divided by 20 plus 100 
तो इट इज़ जीरो पॉइंट वन सेवन वन जीरो पॉइंट वन सेवन वन एम पी आर द डायरेक्शन ऑफ दिस आई प्राइम इज हेयर वी कैन सी द डायरेक्शन ऑफ दिस आई प्राइम इज राइट वर्ड्स इन ब्रैकेट वी विल राइट इट्स डायरेक्शन दैट इज राइट वर्ड्स देन नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू कंसिडर फिफ्टी वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स एंड टर्न ऑफ दिस हंड्रेड वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स सो अगेन वी विल राइट कंसिडर फिफ्टी वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स एंड टर्न ऑफ ऑल अदर सोर्सेस तो नाउ इफ वी टर्न ऑफ दिस हंड्रेड वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स देन दिस विल बी अ शॉर्ट सर्किट Now here we can see the positive terminal is here and negative terminal is here. The direction of current is from positive to negative. So this will be the direction of current in hundred ohm resistance. Now this will be I double prime. Now to find I double prime, we have to use again current division rule. So by using current division rule i double prime is equal to i double prime is equal to let's assume this is total current i so total current i into opposite branch resistance that is 80 ohm divided by 80 plus 100 80 plus 100 so first we have to find this current i in this circuit so here we can see this 80 ohm parallel with 100 ohm so this will be 80 ohm parallel with 100 ohm so this will be 80 into 100 Divided by eighty plus hundred. Eighty into hundred divided by eighty plus hundred. It is forty-four point four. Forty-four point four ohm. Now we will replace these two resistances with forty-four point four ohm resistance. So the so the circuit will be so here this will be forty four point four ohm and this is the value of this is the current so the value of current will be I is equal to V by R and V is fifty divided by R. Now R is twenty plus forty four point four. So fifty divided by twenty plus forty four point four. Fifty divided by twenty plus forty four point four. So this is zero point seven seven six. Zero point seven seven six ampere. But we have to find I double prime. The value of this current I is zero point seven seven six. So we will substitute here zero point seven seven six into eighty divided by eighty plus hundred. So therefore. I double prime 
आई डबल प्राइम इज इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन सिक्स इंटू एटी डिवाइडेड बाय एटी प्लस हंड्रेड एटी डिवाइडेड बाय एटी प्लस हंड्रेड सो इट इज जीरो पॉइंट थ्री फोर फोर जीरो पॉइंट थ्री फोर फोर एम्पियर दिस इज द वैल्यू फॉर आई डबल प्राइम द डायरेक्शन ऑफ दिस आई डबल प्राइम इज हेर वी कैन सी इट इज टू वर्ड्स लेफ्ट वर्ड सो दिस इज लेफ्ट वर्ड नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड अप्लाई सुपर पोजिशन थेरम टू द नेटवर्क शोन इन फिगर फॉर डिटरमाइनिंग द करंट इन हंड्रेड ओम रेजिस्टन्स वी हैव टू डिटरमाइन करंट थ्रू दिस हंड्रेड ओम रेजिस्टन्स सो वी हैव दी वैल्यू फॉर आई प्राइम एंड आई डबल प्राइम सो द करंट थ्रू आई हंड्रेड ओम इज हंड्रेड ओम विल बी Here we can see the direction of this I double prime is leftward, and the direction of current I prime is rightward. So we will subtract higher current minus lower current because the direction is opposite. That's why we are subtracting. If the direction is same, that time we do addition. But here we can see the direction is opposite. So we will subtract higher current. Minus lower current, so this will be zero point three four four minus zero point one seven one zero point one seven one. The direction of this zero point three four four is leftward. and the direction of this 0.171 is towards right words so this will be 0.344 minus 0.171 so it is 0.173 0.173 and the direction will be leftward the unit is ampere so therefore i 100 ohm is equal to 0.173 ampere in leftward direction So this is the final answer